Hello guys, my name is Ismas and I'm back with more Adobe news for Blender. Today they're just going off. This is the third thing they're releasing for Blender. They started off with becoming a patron at the corporate level in the Blender development fund and uh, uh, they have just released two plugins for Blender. Uh, they have released the Substance Adobe Substance 3D uh, plugin for Blender which just lets you import easily uh, materials to Blender and I've installed it uh, in Blender right now but uh, for some reason I can't get it to work. It's just showing this uh, loading thing here uh, but you can see that uh, in the interface I've been success I've successfully installed it and uh, uh, where is it? It's here. Uh, you have this is 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 still limited in feature as uh, if you go to their release page uh the the plugin is still in beta so it may not work for you uh maybe it depends on the version you're using because in the demo it was working fine and uh, everything worked correctly just uh, i'm just going to leave a link in the description for that you can go to the page and see how it works with blender you can see in the demo in their demo here it works quite smoothly you just load in the uh, the substance uh, substance designer or substance uh, substance painter a uh, file and then you sh you're able to access the parameters of that material as you can see here you can access uh, any custom parameters you have set in the substance uh, designer or painter file and uh, you should you, you can access them uh, through your blend file and change the parameters as according to what you want in your model and uh, but uh, when I try to install it it it, it failed uh, to work as you can see let me just reload this file here so that I can show you uh, the installation process is basically the same as any other add-on that uh, Blender has so you just go to edit preferences and then install the add-on as a zip file and uh, you should hit N here and uh, you can find the Substance 3D panel uh, you can also access it in your materials panel here and uh, I, as I said it's still limited in features you have access to you can click a button to get you to the Substance Adobe community uh, page where you can download uh, the substance materials. So, so right now they are, you're only able to load uh, the SB SAR uh, file. You, on this page you have uh, more than three different types of files. The SPSM uh, which are these here are the spheres here, the complete spheres here are the ones that can be loaded into Blender but uh, these ones here as of recording this video this is still a beta version so maybe in the future you'll be able to uh, import uh, these ones i think these are smart materials so you can't import smart materials as of now into blender uh, you can only import these types of materials as, as you can see from the add-on itself and if you go to i think it's this here uh, you can see that uh, if you click on the filter here you can see the file format you can import here and it only shows uh, the sb sar format and uh, if you download any of the two formats of the other formats only this uh this version this format will be able uh, to load in into blender uh, but for some reason i haven't been successful at uh, loading any of them uh, it's still buggy maybe because i'm using uh, a daily build instead of uh, the general release version of blender like uh, blender 2.9 2.9 so if you're trying this if you're trying to see if this works you can try out something like blender 2.9 or 3 but i don't have that installed so yeah another another thing they released was the adobe mixamo auto rig for blender i haven't so i was quite scared about skeptical about uh, the adobe blender relationship because it's, uh, it's adobe doesn't have the best reputation for yeah for working with other projects they usually just end up crushing them so yeah but uh, for now they have released a substance uh painter plugin for, for blender which is quite amazing because now you can easily uh, change the parameters tweak the parameters within blender without having to go back to substance designer which is a plus and then then there is this auto rig uh, plugin for blender yeah that's it thank you for watching see you in the next video